Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am back again with another mukbang. And what I have today is I have a keto breakfast sandwich made with the zero net carb bread. It has two fried eggs, American cheese, two slices of bacon. Um, it has sugar-free ketchup, uh, mayonnaise. And then here I have some more bacon on the side. And I have my keto coffee. You like my new coffee mug? I'm loving it. All right, so I lifted up the plate a little bit so you guys can see the sandwich, but look at this. Let me give you a close-up. Look at that. Oh, so yummy. Mm. Wow. I've never made a breakfast sandwich with this keto bread. It's really good. Mm. Wow. I did toast the bread a little bit. Wow. All the flavors are amazing. Really good. Now, the American cheese is all melted in there. I don't do American cheese often because it's like one of the processed cheeses so it's more like dirty keto but yeah I do it for like when I'm doing like keto burgers or something like that and in this case for my breakfast sandwich mm. This bacon is way better than the one I ate yesterday. I bought two different kinds of bacon at Aldi, and one of them is like extremely salty, like way too salty for my taste. And they used to have one that said low sodium on the package, but I haven't seen it anymore. Oh, and this cup, I don't know if I told you, but it's also from Aldi. <laughs> mm. I got some of the seasonal flavors also. It brings a box. It's a box for the Keurig. And it brings different flavors of coffee. And it's so good. And this one, I believe, is... um caramel cinnamon or something like that. Oh, so good. And then for my creamer. For my creamer, I just put um, sugar-free sweet Italian cream. So good. Mmm. The, the egg is just perfect. I like it a little runny, not too much, but. Mm. So. I've been enjoying AMC Fear Fest. They've been playing awesome movies. You guys know me. The month, <clears throat> all year long, I watch horror movies. But on the month of October, I go a little extra crazy. 
But this month I'm super excited because my friend Veronica is coming to visit me on Sunday. She arrived from Massachusetts. I've known her for many years on here on YouTube, but I've given her many shout outs before in the past. Her channel name is Veronica Bryanton. Yeah. We've known each other for quite some time, but this is going to be like the first time that we're going to meet in person. So I'm super excited about that. Um, also, I'm stoked because her hotel is literally like two blocks away from my house. <laughs> It's really good. I can't believe that I never tried this before. It never occurred to me to make a breakfast sandwich with the keto bread. So, good. so Friday the 13th, the one from 1980, is on AMC right now. I should make these more often. The only thing is that I use my keto bread wisely. Like usually I'll just have like a slice per day and then sometimes if I do want to make a sandwich, I'll make an exception and have two slices, but I don't have any more than that. perfect. Yeah. The eggs came out perfect too. Oh my god. So good. Ooh. Oh, I have to clean that. I got egg yolk. All over my Tales from the Dark Side collection. I was using that to lift up my plate. Mm. You know what the thing is? I bought two types of bacon because I always look at the ingredients because I am baffled as to why some packs of bacon that you buy out there says sugar in the ingredients. Bacon shouldn't have sugar, you know? So I bought the different ones. I bought the regular one that I always buy, which does have sugar, but it's never affected me, but still, like, the word sugar triggers me. <laughs> and then I bought the other one, which is basically just, like, pork. I think it said sea salt and celery powder. No sugar in it. So I was like, oh, cool. Finally a bacon with no sugar. It was, I must have been the sea salt or something. Extremely, I mean, I'm talking about way too much salt on it. So, yeah, today I decided to do the other one. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know if it's part of the process of curing the bacon. I mean, I really don't know, but ever since I've been doing keto, I've been baffled ever since I discovered that some of the bacon packages does say sugar in the ingredients. I've been baffled by it. And like I said, it doesn't affect me, so maybe like the amount is so tiny that it's not gonna really make a difference, but I'm still wondering why. Why does bacon have sugar? Some, not all. But the ones that don't, 
So far from my experience, that was like way too salty for me. Hmm. How much? Hmm. Oh, I'm almost done with the video anyway, but I could have have put my phone on airplane mode. I always put my phone on airplane mode when I'm going to record a video so nobody calls me and knocks out my, <laughs> my video. But I just got a YouTube notification that somebody uploaded a video, so I'm like... I don't get notifications when my phone is on on airplane mode, so I have no idea. Mm. My hands are crazy. I don't know, I never have napkins. Ever. I do, but I, we run out so fast, like... Oh man, that was so good, you guys. I'm definitely gonna make those more often. Not every day, but more often. So good. Okay, I'll go now. Let me finish my video. Okay, I'm recording a video. Okay. You like that, the pumpkin? You like it? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'll put it up now. Let me finish my video. Oh man, that was extremely good. Alright, you guys, so that's it pretty much for this mukbang. Um, I I was like, man, I haven't made a mukbang in so long. I've been so extremely busy. I have so much going on. Like, I mentioned in one of my previous videos with the kids homeschooling and this and that and everything that's going on. Juggling so much at the moment. It's like... <laughs> and I've been doing, like, a lot of stuff. If you guys follow me outside of YouTube, because lately I haven't really been recording everything that I've been doing with my life on YouTube. I haven't really been blogging or anything. But if you guys follow me like on Facebook or Instagram, you'll see that I've been very active lately, you know, like with friends and doing stuff and everything. So, um, and my cousin is in town too visiting from, he lives in Mississippi. He used to live in Ocala, Florida, but then he moved to Mississippi. So he's in town visiting for a few weeks. So, you know, like, there's that going on. Then there's Veronica coming on Sunday. So we're going to be pretty busy. But me and Ver Veronica and I <laughs> are going to vlog together. We're going to do mukbangs together. We're going to do horror movie marathons together. We might even do like a little cooking together. And I am planning to vlog it and record it. And she's also planning to vlog and put it over on her channel. So, you know, when that happens, I will definitely uh, put links down below so you guys can follow her as well and, and subscribe to her. But uh, yeah, I've just had a lot going on. And then today I decided to make this and I was like, you know what, I need to do a mukbang because I've never done a breakfast sandwich like this with the keto bread for a mukbang. So yeah. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this mukbang. I am going to finish the rest of my coffee and my movie and I will see you all in my very next video. All right, guys, take care. If you are new to my channel, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload new videos and click on the description box below for a link to all my social media. And I will see you all in my very next video. All right, guys. Bye-bye.